Hey, what's going on, everyone? I wanted to share with you about the benefits of therapy and, and combining it with coaching and some of the differences and how it, it's able to help me personally. Um, I had someone reach out to me and uh, said that it, they, it would have been helpful to talk a little bit more about therapy because I, I basically just spoke about coaching in my last video. Um, but yeah, also would like to thank all the therapists. I've had many, many different therapists from using Lyra as an employee benefit with LinkedIn. So I'm very grateful for that. And then also having amazing uh, benefits at Bounty Jobs when I was at um, leveraging Trinet. I was able to go to my first therapist when I was really depressed and wasn't sure what I wanted to do and, and just had like a lot of doubt and insecurities. Um, but yeah, I would say the, the distinction between, so therapy tends to be more past-based which obviously there's a lot of help in that as well. Like, And sometimes coaching does go into the past, but it's more meant to be more future focused. So uh, with therapy, um, I've been to a lot of different types of therapists, um, but essentially there's a lot of different types like cognitive behavior, behavioral therapy, there's acceptance therapy. There's a lot of different types of therapy. I would recommend um, going to see multiple therapists to see which one you resonate with the most. Um, I have found that to be very helpful in learning, and I've learned something from each of their styles, right? So I don't think there's necessarily like the best type of therapist. I think there's a lot of different types that work for you. Um, uh, EMDR has been really helpful for me. So that's the, um, it's it has to do with like going back to the past and using eye movement and how we hold different traumas and different parts of our brain. So there's like a, um, so, I would say uh, psychology today is a pretty useful resource if you're fortunate enough to have pretty awesome benefit like Lyra. Uh, definitely take advantage of that. That's made a world of a difference for me. And I still go to therapy today. So it's something that never really goes away, um, you know, depending on how much trauma and one has had in their life. But yeah, I just wanted uh, so thank you to that uh, person who reached out to me to um, kind of uh, suggest that I should talk a little bit more about therapy and just want to make that distinction that coaching is not therapy right they're they're certified in different ways and although there sometimes there are some overlap it tends to be you know if someone has um, schizophrenia bipolar obviously there's people for that so I uh, just want to be responsible in owning that therapy or coaching is not a substitute for therapy but it is very useful i find it very useful to have in conjunction so we have the action plan the future focused coaching that comes with uh, being an ICE international coach federation certified coach versus therapy like really um that compassion and you, you know some some ther therapists also i'm sure go through coaching programs as well right so they're not mutually exclusive um, but just wanted to acknowledge the fact that therapy has made a huge difference in my life. Um, if any if, if any of you are hesitant to see a therapist and you haven't yet, definitely I would you know reach out to me if you want to talk more about it. Um, but yeah, I uh, hope this is helpful for anyone who's is considering therapy and uh, reach out to me if you have any questions.